Hold up. Tell us a little bit about what you're working on at the moment. I know you have that pretty big project on the High Line, the 11th. To talk a little bit about that. Yeah, so we're very excited. It's our uh, ground up full square block development in West Chelsea on the water and then, and then the High Line. And we're here finalizing our second phase of EB5 financing. Is it inexhaustible, the Chinese capital coming into the U.S.? Does there not seem to be any slowdown or anything like that? We've heard a little bit about hiccups in the Chinese economy and last year led to a little bit of a slowdown, but it now seems to be back on track. Well, the money that we're raising, it's not driven by finances, it's mm -hmm. driven by getting a green card and ultimately citizenship. So right. the demand for becoming a U.S. citizen is uns insatiable. Mm -hmm. And the Chinese, with some threat that the half a million dollar threshold may be raised, are actually seeing a sense of urgency to, to get their applications in as quickly as they can. Mm -hmm. Is there a sense of understanding about the High Line and that market in, in, in China? Do they understand that neighborhood yet? I would say a couple of years ago when we did another project at 505 West 19th mm -hmm. Street, they did not really understand the area, but since the opening of the Whitney Museum, Chinese are big art collectors, mm -hmm. the announcement of Google taking additional space, the announcement of all the food courts, Hudson Yards, people recognize this as more of a potential neighborhood.